idcwoodcraft.com. Hi, I'm Garrett with IDC Woodcraft, and welcome to this video where I'm going to talk to you about the Vectric software real quick. I get a lot of emails on a pretty consistent basis from people who have said, Garrett, I have designed this amazing project, I've done all the tool paths for it, and then when I go to generate the code to make my CNC router actually create that amazing project, it won't generate the code. What's going on? It's one of two problems. The first one, is you have not selected a post processor. The post processor is a filter of sorts that tells the software how to write the code for your CNC router in particular. If you don't have the post processor selected, then it's not gonna write the code because it has to have that. But we're not gonna talk about how to solve that problem here. I'm gonna to talk to you about how to solve the other problem. And that is, your software, whether it's Cut2D, VCarve, or Aspire, is not generating code because you are using the trial version of the Vectric software. When we download the trial version, which I did, we're not totally clear that we actually can't generate the code until we actually buy the software. So that's really what's going on as to why your software won't generate code, because you're using the trial version. You have to purchase the software. Now I'm gonna take you into the Vectric software and show you exactly where it's saying it but not being very clear about it i am currently in the vectric aspire version 11 trial version now it doesn't matter what you're using when it comes to the vectric software whether it's aspire the vcarve or the cut 2d they all have this block on them so we've got this very simple project right here uh, just one cut on a square and we're going to go into the save toolpath function and I select that and then we need to select the toolpath so I select that and then we need to pick a post processor right now everything looks normal there's a profile toolpath here we've got something picked here what we haven't done is picked the toolpath and if you look right here it says no post processor is selected so we're going to select a post processor and it doesn't matter right now because it's not going to let me do anything anyway and i'm going to just select g code inch and suddenly we get this warning right here which says sorry the trial version of the software can only save toolpaths for data from the supplied tutorial files what that means is they have created files for you to learn on and it'll only work for those files but it will not work for yours it says please load an unmodified tutorial file to test machine output so this is code for sorry buddy you can't run your stuff unless you buy me and there you have it if you want to run that amazing project of yours that you've done all that design work on then you have to purchase the software I do want to ask that if you decide to purchase the software, I have a special link for that. So if you use that link, I'll get a little bit of credit. It kind of helps me for doing all this content on this channel for you. The link for that is down below. Now, you're not buying it directly from Vectric, you're buying a license through Longmill. You're still buying it directly from Vectric, Longmill is just selling a license. Because I have an affiliate link with Longmill, that helps me out. So that's it. If you want to make that amazing project, you got to buy the software. idcwoodcraft.com